Hello guys, I hope you are all fine. Today we are here to discuss about closed loop operation of a synchronous motor drives. This diagram represents the closed loop operation of a synchronous motor drives. So let's get into the topic. This is the motor, this is the load side converter, this is the source side converter. If you observe here, here the there will be a rotor and also a stator in this motor, and there will be a load side converter as I told you, and there will, three signals will be sent to this terminal voltage sensor. Then the three signals coming out of the outside will be processed by a terminal voltage sensor, which means these three signals will be processed processed by this terminal voltage sensor. If you observe here, the phase delay will delay the phase in order to maintain the beta L constant. If you observe here, this is the phase delay. It will delay the phase in order to maintain this beta L constant. And the, the then the firing circuit will generate pulse to the load side converter. Which means here this is the firing circuit, it will generate the pulse to the load side converter. Now let's discuss about this, this part. This is the source side converter. Here omega m omega r star omega r star omega r star means this is the reference speed, this is the speed, these two will be compared, then the error will be sent to the speed sensor. Then the output of the speed sensor will be sent to the current limiter. This current limiter will generate ID star then it will be sent to this one then it will compare these two id and id star then the error will be sent to this current controller here this current controller will generate some firing pulse and it will send to this source side converter in this way it will work this is all about the closed loop control operation of a synchronous motor drives i hope you understand guys thank you